can get started. So what we'll do is we'll do about a minute, um, Round about one. 30 seconds on each side. Really loosen up the feet. This is a great way to warm up. Really for anything, if you're gonna go bike riding, if you're gonna do yoga, if you're gonna go for a run, it's a really good idea to just loosen up those muscles on the bottom of your feet. It's similar to reflexology, uh, just like those same guys, or the people that push on your feet to find those different spots. You know, if you've been drinking, if you've been eating bad food, you know, certain spots of your foot are gonna hurt more than others. Switch at the 30 second mark and do the other side. Or you can go a little bit longer if you want, but here we're just following along and we're gonna spend about 30 seconds on each foot. Uh, one side's always worse. <sighs> Big deep breaths, we're gonna have some fun today. We're gonna go 30 minutes of uh, exercise. Oh, we're gonna include a warm up. Uh, Start having a seat, opening your legs as wide as you can. Oh, reach forward. We're gonna reach for about 20 seconds here. Then we're gonna switch. Uh, go to the other side. Some of you might be like this, that's okay. You can use a towel or something to increase your range of motion. Big deep breaths all the time, really feel this through there, switch sides, Ugh. you're sitting down all day, the seated V is one of the best stretches just to loosen up the entire body because you also get the lats up there too, just a great overall stretch, good job, Ugh. have a seat on your heels, now you're going to put your hands in front of your knees, put your hand on your head. Touch your elbow to your arm and twist around. And we're just going to do this for 30 seconds. As many as you can. Really trying to rotate and twist around. Switch sides. Here we're loosening up your thoracic spine. Because we're sitting on your heels, your lumbar spine doesn't rotate. And we try to focus on that middle part of our back. That's where all the great swingers twist from. Uh, that sitting fixes your heels down. Uh, you really rotate through your cervical and your thoracic spines. Good job, there you go. Up and down. Push your heels to the ground. Flat, straighten your legs. Uh, exhale as you come up, breathing in. Twist around here, find those tight knots. Now, go up, push your chest down to the floor. Really try to extend and straighten your legs. Push your heels down and then come back up. <sighs> Big deep breaths. Uh, Heels down to the floor. Ankle mobility here. Push your chest down to the mat. Straighten your legs. Ah, exhale as you come up. Now we move a little bit faster. Ah, now we just hit each pose. Ooh, the up and down is an amazing warm up exercise really hits your entire posterior chain, that back of your body. Step. Left leg forward, left hand goes up. Switch sides. Ah. Right leg forward, right hand up. <sighs> Big deep breaths. Bring that foot all the way up by your hand and then rotate around. Big step, boom. Really try to straighten this back leg, right? Here, oh, I step, and then that foot goes right up by my hands. Knee stays in line, it doesn't turn out. Sit, oh, rotate, step all the way up. Straighten your back leg. Rotate that hand in the air. Switch to the other side. Big, long stride. Hand goes down. 
Ooh, rotate around. One more. Oh, good job. Okay. Now we're gonna go into the mad cat. Drop your shoulders down. Lift your chest up nice and high. Each exercise we're doing for about a minute. And sometimes if we switch sides, we're gonna do it for 30 seconds per side, but that's the general gist. Drop your chest down to the floor, collapse your shoulder blades together, and then lift up high. Like you're trying to arch your back up like a mad cat. Drop your chest down to the floor and lift up high. Really try to stretch through your striatus, these ribs, these lats. Right? Really trying to reach up, drop down. Come back up nice and high. You should feel all your rib cage muscles really stretch and pull. Wow, good job. Lie down flat. Bring your hands to the handcuffed position. Okay? Squeeze your elbows together. Right? Clinch there. But don't lift your shoulders up. Don't de no, you elevate your shoulders. Keep your shoulders down. Squeeze. And then come all the way around. Here. Boom. Squeeze. All the way around. Good. Big deep breaths. Boom. This is called the black burn. Here's what I'm doing. When I lie flat, squeeze all the way around. Lift your hands up. Come back around. Squeeze the shoulder blades together. Bring the hands. As I'm coming around, I rotate my hands up. Right, to the supine position, right? Really opens up your entire back. Flip over onto your backside. Lie down. Push your hips up into the air. Squeeze your butt cheeks together. And then down. Up. Clinch your glutes as hard as you can, and then relax. Up for one, two, three, and then we relax. Good, up for one, two, three, and then we relax. Good, if you sit down all day, your butt gets stretched out. If you stretch a muscle, you relax a muscle. That muscle gets turned off, so now, we're waking up our butt muscles so that they work during the workout. Squeeze and then down. Up, squeeze and then down. Good job, one more. Clinch and then relax, good job, okay. Beautiful. Stand up, catch your breath. Balance on one leg. Lift this leg up. Reach your hands out. Good. Posture. Stomach tight. Relax your arms. Depress your shoulders. Lift your leg. Reach your hands out in front. Boom. As you come down, right, as I'm moving, my body moves with my leg, and then I lift my hands. And then relax. Switch sides. Here. Boom. Yeah. Weaker side. Lift the leg. Lift the hands and then back. Good posture. Lift the leg and lift the hands. Good. The legs and the upper body move at the same time. And then lift. Boom. Right back up. Switch to the other side. 30 more seconds. Good balance. Lift the leg. Good posture. Lift the leg. Lift the arm. Same time. And then back. Lift the leg, lift the hands, big deep breaths, reach, and then back. Try to get an even amount on both sides. Count how many you do in 30 seconds. Switch sides. Boom. Good posture. Lift the leg, lift the hands. Good posture. Stomach tight. Keep your head up. Last one. 
Good job. Big deep breaths. Drink a little water. basic movement patterns, gets all of our back muscles turned on, all of the front muscles a little looser, okay? So now we're going to go into the core part. 30 seconds front plank. Good posture. Now on the front plank, I'm trying to squeeze my butt cheeks together and lift my head up, all right? Squeeze my glutes together Suck in my stomach. Really try to pull your gut in. All right, head stays back. Squeeze. Good. Clinch the glutes. Pull the head up. Suck the gut in. And time. Good. Thirty seconds. We'll bring this guy down. The warm up was about ten minutes. The workout's going to be about twenty. Big deep breaths. We're going 30 on, 30 off, 30 on, 30 off. Good posture. Remember, pull the head back. If you can, you can move up to the next one. If not, just do the front plank again. That's fine. You don't have to go with me, but I'm going to twist this time. Here, front plank, and I rotate around. Really get a good twist. My body moves together. All right. And now if you get tired, you can always drop to the knees and just stay here, right? Or go back to the front. You don't have to roll. You don't have to keep going. Boom. Ten more seconds. Then you get a rest. All the way around. Last one. Right there. Okay. Gonna rest for 30. Grab some water if you want. Okay, now the last one, we're gonna do this four times actually, so we're gonna do four sets. The next one is we're gonna move our hips from side to side, okay? Head stays back, stomach stays in, glutes stay on. 30 seconds, here we go, glutes, and we bounce our hips, and we twist. You really feel this through your obliques and your stomach as you twist around. Keep your head back. Don't let your head drop down. Keep the head up. All the way around. Yes. 10 seconds. Five seconds. Pull the head up. Time. Good job. One more. 30 seconds of rest. 30 seconds of work. Okay? Try to hang in there, keep pushing. All right? If you need a little bit longer rest, just hit pause. You can rest a little longer, all right? But we're gonna do one more for the last 30 seconds. And this time, we'll get our heart rate up a little bit and we'll do jacks. Here we go. Good, again, we pull the head up. Try to suck the stomach in. is going to be with a water bottle, right? It doesn't matter what size the water bottle is. The bigger the water bottle, the better the workout. But you can do all this stuff with one of these, okay? Something, anything. Fill it up, add a little bit of resistance, and you can train along, okay? So, we got about 20 seconds left in our rest. One minute, the planks, and now the circuits, okay? Got a five gallon water jug that I'm gonna use as my resistance. I'm gonna do three movements. First one is gonna be the deadlift, straight leg, good posture. Then I'm gonna row and then I'm gonna press. 
Here we go. I like this grip. And there. You're gonna pull through the legs. It's good posture. Look, look, my head is tucked, my stomach's tight, and I pull my shoulders back together. Good posture, chest up high. Give yourself a double chin. Not a good picture, but it really works to pull your head back and strengthen your neck muscles. Five seconds, two. Now we stay here and we row, all right? Now the grip, I'm gonna switch it to the other hand next time. But here, I'm really still getting a good squeeze through my back. Don't shrug up. Keep your shoulders depressed and pull. Gotta keep your back straight and your head tucked in. Too much of this, too much of this. Head stays neutral with the rest of the spine. Ah, ah. Now, the switch. Now we press. Oh, for 30. Stomach tight. Posture, stable. I like the split squat or the split stance where I separate my legs, push all the way up. Last. Ah. Ah. And time. Oh. 30 seconds of work on each exercise. 30 seconds of rest, okay? You gotta recover. Now, might not be long enough rest. You can hit pause, okay? Now, you can do all these. You're just one of these guys. Look, row, deadlifts, the presses. Any size water bottle will work, okay? Eight seconds. Whew. Big deep breaths. Let's go. Deadlifts. Good posture. Stomach tight. Okay. Posture is very important. Here. Here. All right. Now we row. Now I'm going to switch my grip. So this side. Good posture, head back, head stays neutral, right? Not up, not down. Head stays neutral, and we row. Uh, okay, now we breath. Nuts, man. Oh, let's go one more time. 
gotta push our bodies. Gotta fatigue yourself. Gotta make yourself tired. Uh, push your body. See what you're capable of. Uh, uh, stomach tight. Legs. Again, we're going to do three exercises. But this time, it's going to be for the lower body, and you're going to need two Tupperware lids. Okay? Ideally, you got something like this. Right? These are called bow slides. They work on carpet and smooth surfaces. But these work too. It just makes it a little bit more difficult. We're starting out with the leg curls, and then we're going to do a lunge. A reverse lunge. Okay? Here we go. Taking about a minute. Big deep breaths. A okay. little water. Oh. And lie down. Take your slides. Now, here, slippery. Okay. Lie down. Hips up. Cool. Curl, curl. Look, as I curl, I lift my hips up into the air. Boom. It's one unit. Or you can go here and here. Right? You can go here, here, and then here. Here, here, and then there. But you can move everything at the same time. Right? Stand up. Put your foot on one of them. Chest up nice and high. You're lunging back. One, two, three. Lunge back, pull it forward with the front of your hips. Athletic stance, athletic posture. I'm run, running forward, so I'm pulling my leg upwards. Something different for your legs rather than just regular squats and lunges. Switch sides. Lunge back. Lunge back. Left leg forward, right hand goes up like I'm sprinting. Here, 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 here. Good for the back leg, good for the front leg. Stability on the front, strength on the back. Get tired. 30 seconds of rest. Remember, quality over quantity. Focus on good, clean repetition with perfect posture. Let's go back to the leg curl. Big deep breaths. Get water, right? Your legs might be cramping. You might need to stretch a little bit. Get pause, and that's okay. All right? Let's go. Break. One. Two. Three. Bend these out. Lift your hips as you come in. Keep your stomach tight. Okay. Uh, 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 15. Wow. Lucky go. Switch legs. Let's start with the other leg first. Lunge back. Good posture. Athletic stance, right leg forward, left hand up, right leg forward, left hand up. Lunge back, lunge back, left leg forward. Right hand goes up like I'm sprinting. Here, 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 here. Good for the back leg, good for the front leg. Stability on the front, strength on the back. Ah. Oh. Ten seconds. 
Here we go. Last one. Let's make it the best one. Last one. Best one. Last one. Best one. Go to the other side. Try to keep your knees in line with your hips. Don't let your knees come out. Don't let your knees come in. Good. Lift your hips as you curl in so they move as a unit. Ah, 10 seconds. Almost there. Five. Four. Ah. Oh. Whew. Up you go. Lunge it one more time. Good job. the athletic posture. I'm going to keep my head up slightly tilted. Here. But I don't want to hang down. Ah. Almost there. Whew. Huh. Ah. Switch sides. Last one. Bring your foot into the middle of the rib. Whew. Whew. Alarm sounds, but you keep going. Ah, last one. Good job. Okay. Whew. One minute. All right. No. No. Good job. Big deep breaths. Slow your breath down. All right. In combat sports, you got one minute between each rounds. So that's kind of like my gauge, right? How close I am to that kind of condition where you're ready to go at the end of the 60 seconds, you know? Big deep breaths. Last one we're gonna do. Okay, here we go. Push-ups, mountain climbers. Burpees. Let's do this. Ah, we can go here. This is fine too. Okay, but notice when I do it, my hips don't drop and my head doesn't drop. The head stays up, the stomach stays tight, the butt stays on. This is extremely important. Don't do push ups like this. Okay? So many push ups gone wrong. Okay, head back, stomach tight. Chest down first. Good job. Mountain climbers, here we go. Bop, bop. Head stays up. Don't drop the head down. You gotta keep your head up. Keep your head up. Ba, 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 da, da, da. Keep your head up. Ba, ba. Oh. Oh, the arms are frying. straight back into a plank. Maintain the plank. Bring your feet back up. Stand up in a good squat. That was the test. 30 seconds. Big deep breaths. Big deep breaths. Okay, that was the one. We still got a bit longer, right? We're gonna use this time to rest, and we're gonna do it again. Yeah? Maybe two more. I think I got two more in me. Do you have two more in you? Well, let's go. Come on. Push-ups. Now, again, this is fine. Right? On the knees, stomach tight, head back. You want to make it nasty, you bring yourself up, chest down first. Head goes up, chest down first. Head goes up, chest goes down. Hold. Oh, man. 
Hold right here. Oh man. Oh man. Time. Okay. Mountain climbers. Let's go. Let's do this. Head stays up. Come on. Bonus time. Bonus time. Ah. Hang in there. Come on. Come on. Drive the knees up into the arms. The knees. Come all the way up. Oh. Time. Burpees. Come on. Let's have the jump. Let's have the jump. Oh. Come on. Hang in there. Let's go. Ah, oh, 30 seconds. Let's do one more, okay? Come on, slow your breath down. Arms are on fire. Just like in that fourth round, right? Tired, lungs are blown, and you know the dude across the ring from you is ready to go. Oh. So you gotta pretend that you're not tired. Oh, pretend you're not tired. Just poke the face one more time. Let's go. Come on. Last one. Get some. Last one. Best one. Last one. Best one. You can do any kind of push up you want. You can make them fancy. Right? You can make them different as you get stronger. You can add power. Oh, mountain climbers, last one, best one, last one, best one, ah. come on, Ooh. move on back, no excuse not to rest, ah. come on, come on, beat me, beat me, come on, Switch sides. Ah. 
Good stretch for the glute here. We want to slow our breath down. Good job. We'll stay here another 10 seconds, and we're gonna drop this leg down to the floor. Good job, here we go, ready? Last 20 seconds. We'll be right here. If you've got other muscles that are tight, use this time to stretch those. So you wanna focus on the recovery aspect at the end, bring down your heart rate, but loosen up those tight muscles that were pulling you in the wrong direction during the workout. Everybody's got different tight muscles. So the objective is to find them, correct your imbalances by strengthening your weaknesses and loosening up the muscles that are pulling you in the wrong direction. Good job, last one. We'll end this right where we started. Coming forward. Reaching forward. Now, some of you might be only here. Some of you might need to lean your back up against something. That's okay. All right, but just says you need to focus a little bit more on flexibility too. Inhale. Chest down. Good job. 36 minutes. That was a good one. Thanks for joining me, guys. See you next time.